I'll just wait till he enters the door on this one. the game Grand Theft Auto 5. Yes, Just pour a gasoline trail right, and shoot it. You got fire. Sounds like what they did to Tracy on Grand Theft Auto 5. They drugged her. Said that whenever, whenever uh, I was just going to take off the cuffs, whenever I was going through that hospital, I was like, "Cuffs, please. I need to sign these papers." This video is just pretty much what y'all heard on the video just now was <laughs> what it was about, pretty much. Uh, the guy called the cops saying his weed was stolen. Takes them an, an hour to get there, which of course he'll start saying 911 is a joke until they finally get there. Of course, he enters the door and just right off the bat starts mouthing off to them. Just right then. Of course, I think it's pretty funny. I mean, 
it's for entertainment purposes only. I mean, this video isn't to discriminate against anybody that actually would do something like that. But, I mean, I just thought it would be a funny video to actually actually watch and review because eventually he'll start explaining what that there was a party he he went to a bar got drunk uh, crashed his car set it on fire uh, went back to his house where the party was already happening uh, of course not only was they doing marijuana, but he also snorted cocaine. Most he's ever done. Uh, um, held, held a girl against her will, which she was screaming, so they ended up slipping her some THC, which is, of course, resin from uh, the marijuana after you smoke it. Don't ask me how I know that. That's a secret for me to know and you ought to find out. <laughs> <laughs> Which would be never, uh, because I don't plan on explaining what exactly how that works. Uh, it's sorry, I didn't know. So it um, so eventually he explains all that. Then he explains that eventually he went outside to get a sandwich, which he stole because he isn't he didn't have any money. He got back. All his weed was gone. So, of course, they started explaining everything. So, make sure they got it right. They explained everything except his weed getting stolen. So, as soon as he says that again, they think it'll be. They think it's a great idea just to arrest him right there. Because they said everything he told them was illegal. Uh, well, kind of is. It kind of is. But I can see where that, that guy is coming from. If I was in his situation, I would be pretty mad too about my weed getting stolen. But I wouldn't call the cops about it. I mean, come on. That's that's a stupid. Don't call the cops about it unless it's legal. I mean, if it's legal, well, sure, go ahead. But I mean, that's just the way that is. I mean, so they arrest him, and then he just stops them in their tracks. Just now, then, what if he had an information about a murder? Of course, they could have notched some of that down if he would have, but he kind of ruined that for himself due to the fact he was the murderer in question. So, of course, he, they cuff him again and end up, and of course, he ends up saying he's the stupidest man in the world, which, of course, yeah. I mean, that part, I can understand him getting arrested for that part. I mean, it's... I mean, murder? Yes. Or the weed? No, I don't understand that. I mean, it's already proven that it's to help keep people calm. It's already a proven fact. I mean, to help their anxiety their, and their depression issues. I mean, it helps with some of the worst issues anybody could have and more than what the medicine will but that was the video uh, that was and that was me explaining it uh, if you liked this video please hit that like button if you're new to my channel please subscribe for more videos thank you and have a good day